Welcome to ReneeEnergy.com on YouTube, the hub for all things renewable energy and sustainability. Our channel is dedicated to bringing you the latest innovations and insights in green energy, including cutting-edge developments like green hydrogen. Whether you're a sustainability veteran or just beginning your journey, we have something for everyone. Join us on this channel to explore inspiring projects for a sustainable tomorrow. We bring you the latest in renewable energy, sustainability, and cutting-edge technologies. And don't forget, for more in-depth information and resources, visit our website and subscribe to our newsletter for the latest updates and exclusive content. Hello, energy enthusiasts. Welcome back to ReneeEnergy.com. Today, we're tackling a burning question that many of you have been asking, how much for a full tank of hydrogen? As the world pivots towards sustainable energy, hydrogen fuel emerges as a beacon of hope. Hydrogen fuel, which powers fuel cell electric vehicles, FCEVs, is produced through the chemical process of electrolysis, splitting water into hydrogen and oxygen. The resulting hydrogen is then used to generate electricity in the vehicle's fuel cell, emitting only water vapor as a byproduct. It's a clean alternative to fossil fuels, but is it affordable? Let's dive into the hydrogen economy and uncover the true cost of this clean energy source. The price tag on clean energy. Hydrogen fuel cell vehicles, like the Toyota Mirai, symbolize a step towards a sustainable future. Yet, the cost to fill them up might surprise you. With hydrogen prices soaring to $36 per kilogram, a full tank could set you back over $200. To put that into perspective, if a gasoline-powered car and a hydrogen fuel cell vehicle have the same size tank, filling up the FCF would be about three to four times more expensive. But what drives these high costs? Several factors influence the price of hydrogen fuel. Firstly, the production process itself is energy intensive and expensive. Whether it's through steam methane reforming, gray hydrogen, or electrolysis powered by renewable energy, green hydrogen, producing hydrogen requires significant upfront costs. Additionally, the infrastructure for hydrogen fueling stations is still in its nascent stages, with only a limited number of stations available. The scarcity of fueling stations means that the cost of building and maintaining them is spread across a smaller number of consumers, driving up prices. Furthermore, the technology used in hydrogen fuel cell vehicles is still relatively new and expensive, contributing to the overall cost of operating these vehicles. Green hydrogen, the ideal versus the reality. As we quest for cleaner alternatives to fossil fuels, green hydrogen stands out as the ideal solution. Produced entirely from renewable resources like solar or wind power, green hydrogen promises a truly emissions-free fuel source. However, the path to widespread adoption of green hydrogen is fraught with economic and environmental challenges. One of the main hurdles is the high electricity demand for water electrolysis, the process used to produce green hydrogen. Splitting water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen requires a significant amount of electrical energy. In fact, producing just one kilogram of hydrogen through electrolysis can consume up to 50 kilowatt hours of electricity. To put that into context, the average U.S. household consumes about 877 kilowatt hours per month. So, producing a single kilogram of green hydrogen would use about as much electricity as powering a home for two days. Moreover, the current infrastructure for green hydrogen production and distribution is still in its early stages. While there are ambitious plans to scale up green hydrogen projects, the reality is that we're still far from having a robust network of green hydrogen production facilities and fueling stations. This limited infrastructure contributes to the high cost of green hydrogen, as the production and distribution costs are spread across a smaller user base. The Environmental Cost-Benefit Analysis Transitioning to hydrogen fuel promises a significant reduction in carbon emissions, particularly when the hydrogen is produced through clean methods. However, it's essential to consider the environmental impact of different hydrogen production methods and how they influence the overall cost and sustainability of hydrogen fuel. Currently, the majority of hydrogen is produced through steam methane reforming, which relies on natural gas as a feedstock. This method, known as gray hydrogen production, still results in carbon emissions, as the process involves separating hydrogen from methane. While gray hydrogen is currently the most cost-effective production method, it does not offer the full environmental benefits of clean hydrogen. Blue hydrogen aims to bridge the gap by capturing and storing the carbon emissions from steam methane reforming. This approach reduces the carbon footprint of hydrogen production but adds additional costs for carbon capture and storage technologies. Green hydrogen, as discussed earlier, offers the most environmentally friendly option by using renewable energy to power electrolysis. 
However, the high electricity requirements and the need for a significant scale-up of renewable energy infrastructure make green hydrogen the most expensive production method currently. As we weigh the environmental benefits against the economic costs, it's clear that transitioning to clean hydrogen will require significant investments and policy support. Governments and industry leaders will need to work together to drive down costs, improve efficiency, and build out the necessary infrastructure to make clean hydrogen a viable alternative to fossil fuels. A glimpse into the future, is hydrogen fuel economically viable? As we peer into the future, the question of whether hydrogen fuel can become economically viable looms large. The current high costs of hydrogen production, distribution, and fueling infrastructure present significant barriers to widespread adoption. However, there are reasons for optimism. Advancements in technology hold the key to reducing the costs of hydrogen fuel. Researchers and industry leaders are working on developing more efficient electrolysis methods, such as high-temperature electrolysis, which could significantly reduce the electricity requirements for green hydrogen production. Additionally, the falling costs of renewable energy sources like solar and wind power could make green hydrogen more cost-competitive in the coming years. Moreover, governments around the world are recognizing the potential of hydrogen as a clean energy solution and are implementing policies to support its growth. Initiatives such as tax incentives, subsidies for hydrogen fueling infrastructure, and funding for research and development could help drive down costs and accelerate the adoption of hydrogen fuel. However, it's important to note that the transition to a hydrogen-powered society will not happen overnight. It will require sustained efforts and investments over the coming decades to build out the necessary infrastructure and scale up production to meet the growing demand for clean energy. Wrapping up, the price of progress. As we contemplate the question, how much for a full tank of hydrogen? We're faced with the broader implications of our energy choices. The high cost of hydrogen fuel reflects the challenges we face in transitioning to a sustainable energy future. It's a reminder that progress often comes with a price tag, whether it's the upfront costs of building new infrastructure or the investments needed to drive technological advancements. Yet, the price of inaction is far greater. The environmental and social costs of our continued reliance on fossil fuels are becoming increasingly clear, from air pollution and climate change to geopolitical instability and energy insecurity. As we weigh the costs and benefits of hydrogen fuel and other clean energy solutions, we must consider the long-term value of a sustainable future. The journey towards a hydrogen-powered society is not without its obstacles, but it's a path we must embark upon if we hope to create a cleaner, more resilient world for future generations. It will require collaboration, innovation, and a willingness to invest in the technologies and infrastructure that will power our future. As we wrap up this deep dive into the economics of hydrogen fuel, we invite you to join the conversation. Share your thoughts, questions, and ideas with us at renewenergy.com. Together, we can explore the innovations that will pave the way for a sustainable world, one tank full of hydrogen at a time. Thanks for tuning into the ReneeEnergy.com YouTube channel. We trust you found this episode enlightening and motivating. There's a world of innovation and opportunity in sustainable energy, and we're delighted to share this journey with you. Stay in the loop with the latest on renewable energy and sustainability by visiting our website and subscribing to our newsletter. Your support is immensely appreciated, it's truly invaluable to us. Don't miss our next video on new trends in renewable energy. Follow us on social media for the latest updates. Enjoy the video? Like, subscribe, and share for more green insights. Thanks for watching.